Hello and welcome to Bees on Main here in beautiful downtown Stoughton, Wisconsin. I'm Rich Morris, lead grower and broodminder, and I'm here to uh, request your help if you happen to have apiaries along the path of totality of the Great American Eclipse next month on April 8th, uh, or as we like to call it, the Great American Beeclipse. We were approached a couple of days ago by a consortium of researchers led by Barrett Klein at UW at University of Wisconsin along with uh, Brock Harper at Purdue and Manuel Guzman at uh, Vanderbilt. And they're doing some follow-up work on uh, an experiment they started seven years ago with the last eclipse. So we talked about various possibilities and got excited about a couple of things. The first is we would like to install about 200 BDARs uh, from southern Texas through northern Ohio in apiaries and basically strap a specially modified BDAR to the front of a hive and watch the flight and sound information from it every 15 minutes and then on the day of the eclipse we'll shift it to once every minute and we're hoping to see the effect of, of the eclipse on these on these bees. Once the data is collected then it will be returned to us and we will offload the data and it will all be really simple for the beekeeper out there. Uh, the second is for our current users uh, who have equipment in the path. We'll, we're making a special version of the Bees app and that Bees app will let you shift from uh, the normal one hour data collection to a one minute sample rate during the eclipse. Uh, we're hoping it shows something in the weight or the temperature data but you know this is basic research so we really don't know. One way or the other it'll prove is there an effect or is there not. Uh, the third thing is a special request from uh, from Barrett, he is especially interested in bee dance behavior and he's done some fantastic work in this. So if you have an observation hive along the path, then we'd really like to talk to you and see if we can uh, have you observe the dance behavior during the eclipse. We're doing all this, uh, we're posting the details at broodminder.com. Uh, this is all happening very quickly so keep checking in there and we'll be updating it as we get, go along. So, I mean, if you or anyone you know you know, has an apiary along the path, uh, we'd you know, love for you to check it out and, and see if you can participate with this. We love this sort of research. Uh, because of that, we're donating the use of the BDARs during this uh, project. Uh, we are requesting a $25 uh, shipping and handling fee to help defray that cost. Um, as a final note, you know, we're not making any money on this. It's uh, sort of interrupting our spring ramp up, but we're super excited about this project. Uh, because, you know, we love science and because every hive counts.